All right, y'all. So I just came in um, at the last minute. My man said, hey, if you want to go anywhere, you can go. I got off work early today. And I decided, I was like, I'll come look for some pennies or whatever. I wanted to try to find some of the new ones, but found these. And this is a store <clears throat> that are, is really good at putting up their pennies. Like all these Gucci brands right there. I don't think those are. I think those are newer. But these, I got all of these out of the same spot. As if somebody just grabbed them out of the back and sat them all right here. So I'm about to scan the rest of these. The Bell or Belly, Belly or whatever. I'm about to scan the rest of these. They were all literally sitting right here on top. Is this one right here? Oh, I'm not sure, but I'll check. So yeah, guys, that's what I'm doing. And I just got in here. This is my first store, and it's about probably 5 p.m. now. So it's my first time outside. And again, if you hear my voice like this, it's because I do have on the mask. And um, it's a little muffled. I'm going to scan that. I literally like always check this one last because they're really good at putting up their pennies. This is the one that I was in. Um, if you guys saw that one video when I walked in the store and she was um, pulling the cigarettes. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, I know she would have gave me a couple packs if I asked her. She's really cool here. They all are. Uh, let me scan some stuff and see what we get. What we got there already? Yeah, this is my first time finding the vacuum cleaning bags. And I was actually looking up here. Hold it back a little bit so you can see. That's a Lani holding the camera. And I was digging through all these trying to find more hair stuff. And this was back here behind all of this stuff. Try to put the camera back here so they can see. It was back here, guys. All of this so. I've been here for a million times and never moved all of these stickies. I finally found this. They hold it because Alani got the camera from everywhere. So, yay! I'm about to move all of these little stickers. I told you, when you do it, move stuff in the box next to you. And then you can move it, like, out of the Move it back when you're done so you're not making a mess. I've never seen these. I've never seen. Um, oh, look at the little bow. So I'm gonna scan this stuff. There's one right there. Look, right there. Oh, and you got one right here. That green and blue one we know for sure is one, so you could put that in there. But you know what? You know what? I'm gonna still scan it because I tell you guys to still scan it, even if it looks like something you've gotten before. Um, you got one. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. two are the same. I'm telling them, you know, we're gonna still scan it even though we see they're identical, but it could be one number off with the barcode. And I've even scanned something one time. I think it had the same barcode, but one was a different price. Like, I believe that was on the pacifiers. Okay. I think, um, no, that's not one. I always see that one. But let me check these guys and I'll be back. The coupons went through just fine? Okay, <laughs> no problem. I'm going to scan. Alani, yeah. I scanned those masks up front, right? I think so. 
So um, I got the high chew coupons, you guys, and I just gave that lovely customer a pair of some, and she's gonna enjoy. So you too. Um, she was thanking me because I had like 13 we cut out, so you can only use four at a time. So we're gonna do um three different transactions since I got my girls here. They do four. I do four, and then my I do four. But uh, that looks like more than four, isn't it? How many other? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Two, three, four. Just four. Five. You got five, so just give me one. I'll do one. Right. And get your four on there. You got all of them, or did you get four? Yeah, four. Okay, so I need one. I'll get, get one. I'll we'll get one. Here, yeah, put those in. You got one. Okay. Uh-oh, what ring up for a dollar? Um, I think the bell comes. Let me see. Oh, yeah, that's what we're supposed to do the price check on. Yeah, can we take that off? Alana, you weren't supposed to put that up there because it didn't scan for me on my phone, sure. so I was supposed to take it off. The comb. So that's what, let me see. This is what rang up for a dollar, you guys. It didn't scan for me on my phone. That's okay, why 19, I brought it up there to check. Thank you. My total is 19. So I stopped by the dumpster, you guys, and I just see a bag full of these jungle cookies and these jalapeno pino potato chips. But they got all of this in front of the dumpster. I was like, why, oh why do they have this blocking the dumpster? <laughs> so, these, I'm gonna throw these back because these weren't inside the bag. Oh, a lamp, I didn't even see that, Maya. And it's a box down there. This is the bag right here that I ripped open. That's a lot of stuff. You got combos in there. Well, you see combos? Well, you gotta get everything. Oh, they tripping. They are tripping. Combos. Mommy, what's, um, what do you see, Lonnie? Come over here, because I don't even know what it is. Ooh, don't splash that water on me. I know it's just rainwater, but. Ooh. Thinking it's dumpster juice. Did Alani really just die in the dumpster? Oh. What are they? Paint buckets or something? What does it say? Soft bait. Lani, I need you to get these. Here, Maya's gonna pass me the combos. Well, we ain't got nothing to put it on. It's too nasty to put it on the ground. Here, yeah, we can do this. Put it on this side. They dumpster clean. You know this. Lani, I need you to come on this side for me. And you done dove in and you riding on the roof back home. Flower in here. I need you to get this lamp. I don't see what that is. I need you to get this lamp right here. She was asking me what that is, guys. They got a whole tire in here. Apple juice? What? This dumpster, I never can really catch them with anything in here. Oh my gosh, a freaking blender. Um, do you want these? No, the biscuits gotta be cold. I don't want those biscuits. I got something on it, but I'll take it. Yeah, those are open. I will take this lamp. Isn't this one of the penny lamps, you guys? I think so. Still got the tag on it. I'll take it. Peppers. Combo. This is probably what the packs look like inside that box. Let me go get a bag really quick. We got those chips right there. I'm glad you got on your dirty shoes, Lonnie. Wait, back up. Don't walk further in there. Come in the corner. Let me see that white bag. Can you rip that? There's a drink right on the side. Hmm? A drink? Oh, yeah, but it got shit all over it. Don't touch anything in that bag. Just rip it. Let me see. Or this could be their personal bathroom trash or something. I'll Wipes? touch it. See, 
see if anything in there. All the lights. Nope. Empty. All right. Uh, all right. Let me get back to the car. Yeah, for... Uh oh, I'm about to get a bag. I ain't gonna take that box back with us. Maya grabbed more bags anyway, so um, we can have when we go to the market. Oh, well, here's one too, but she grabbed the handful when she grabbed uh, my stuff off of the, the roller thing. I'm like, we can't see anything while we're back here. Somebody could have took the damn phone. Here, Alani, help Lani. her. Ew, you got shit flying off of you. You gotta, Alani, you she should, of all people, know how to dumpster dive without stuff touching your clothes. Get down. No, that's what Help she her bag that, and I'm gonna um spray you down thoroughly. Oh, guys. Where's my hand sanitizer? I just affect this spray. It was Lonnie who suggested that we check the dumpster today. I was thinking like, eh, we're going to find nothing. The wipes are down here. Or so dirty. Clocks wipes. There's the sanitizer. Get that ready for them. Let them put on our new perfume, which is now our new normal. Ah, don't get in my car, and I have to spray that stuff. All right. That's all we got, guys. Toastmaster, lamp, and a bunch of snacks. Okay, so I'm in the second store, y'all. And um, I scan these bandanas. They are all one cent. But the problem is, I've heard the word in the curve that they are refusing to sell you bandanas. That once it gets to the register and they ring it up, they scan it, it's going to say, do not sell. I'm not sure it's because of the riots or everything that's going on, but all of these bandanas are right there. And I gotta get from over here because there's a real moldy smell over here and it stinks so bad. It's a strong scent of mold. Uh, I wonder if it's coming from up there or somewhere. Hi camera. But yeah, um, hopefully they don't refuse to sell me these because this store knows me. But it's a girl up there that's like really nice. But then again, she kind of goes by the rules. So we're going to see who's here because I see a lot of new people here. So we'll see. Okay, guys. So um, I didn't find anything else besides the bandanas. I've been in here about 30, 45 minutes. I found a rug. It doesn't have a tag or UPC number. I'm going to see if I can get away with getting it for a penny as well. But the only thing that sucks is, I mean, I wish I had something else for a penny. Just in case I do have problems with the bandanas at the register, then they have something else to scan. Like if I had 13 bandanas, they can scan, say this was a penny, they can scan this 13 times. But this is what I brought to show you guys. This is um, scanning for 60 cents. I don't know if this is um, part of like purple dot, this stuff right here. I know these are green dot, I think. Yeah, green dot. Um, these are 60 cents. Uh, were these regular price? Mm -hmm. Yeah, regular price, $2. These are 60 cents. The mask is only one left. These loofers mm -hmm. are 60 cents. What? Oh, the spa glove. Oh, this is in the wrong spot. No, it's totally in charcoal, body proof. Gel, hand gloves. Okay, you're right. $5. No, well, I scanned. Well, I guess it's $2 now. Because I think I scanned it. These are three dollars still, so I'm gonna get these loofers. Um, uh -uh. They are originally two dollars, I guess. Yes, charcoal exfoliating charcoal body proof. I'm gonna get these for sixty cent a piece. Um, I don't want to wait till they penny because we need loofers, so and they feel like good quality as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and get those and probably that face mask. I don't too much care about the bath bombs. The only time I get those is if they are a penny or something like that. So that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Why are you running? Get off my back. Why are you running? Why are you running? You want five dollars? 
Look, <laughs> got her, got her. All right, you guys, so yeah. I'm checking top shelves. Remember I tell you guys to always check top shelf, top shelves and overstock. I scanned that little blanket because I know it doesn't say snuggle, but somebody did tell me snuggle blanket or something like that was a penny. Uh, I didn't scan this one, but I know I've been scanning it a million times every time I see it. But I still haven't found a snuggle blanket. They said it was as seen on TV like those are. But I always check the overstock because when they pull pennies, sometimes they forget. Like for instance, um, those shoes right there are yellow dot. When yellow dot pennies, they're probably just gonna go to the shoe section and pull those and forget that they have these over here. So, yeah. And like goggles, those pennies, you see those are right there. Like that's how you find stuff, guys, out of place whenever you do find it. Oh, it showed in my face. Okay, um, yeah. So this is all I'm gonna get, guys. Let's see how this goes with the bandanas. Oh uh, yeah. So you had already known what I was doing when you saw me with the bandanas? She just told me, she said, hey, if a girl comes up with bandanas, call me. And I'm like, okay. Okay. Did you No. What did it say, like, when it popped up? Do not sell? It says that I can't sell them. Yeah. Ooh, one thing. He took you to the back like the other ones, though. Oh, he took that on his back? Mm-hmm. Hello? Hey, so what are you going to do about the bandanas? Because you can't do not sell on the computer. The bandanas? Let's see another one. And these are like about three, get one, two. But was that a digital coupon or you don't know? Because I, I think it was. Yeah. If not, I, I, I don't think it's a digital. Because I, I clipped it and um, once I just saw it, and I was like, oh, it's a digital too? And then it said it over there on the end cap. He said what? Just bag them up. Oh, just bag them up? Okay. So she's going to have to. Okay. Yeah, it's not taking on, so I guess it you must be with You took all of them out better? Okay, yeah. Okay. They were um over here, and I just grabbed all of them. I wish they would stop trying new stuff. Uh, I did try those in Walgreens before they gave us the digital for so I think I was like the first one to get it. But I wish they really stopped trying new stuff. They're ruining everything. Of course, the Purex is on sale in Walgreens, and I have no coupons for it. Fifty percent off. All right, guys. I know this is not a Walgreens video. This is the penny video, but this was my last stop. And um, Walgreens. That's why I'm talking close to the phone, the camera, so I won't get copyrighted. Maya was saying I was gonna get copyrighted. But I am not. So my car is looking crazy. This is not even a grocery store. And my daughter's got me getting all this stuff. See, that's why, you know, I don't think I was selling sanitizer really good um, at the market. Because I find it everywhere now. The soap that everybody was going crazy for. Wipes, alcohol. Someone did ask me for alcohol, though, at one of my stands. How much are these masks? Doesn't even say. Oh, five ninety nine. That's good for the phone. Yeah, I paid four ninety nine for the one on my face, and this is one. So, um, yeah, guys, I've already walked around the whole store looking for orange stickers, and some of them are the same, and haven't dropped. But don't be discouraged when I tell you guys to look for orange stickers every day you go in your store because I also run into new ones. And this is one of the new ones. But I love to wait for these to drop to 90% off. Uh, maybe of that price and they'll be 37 cents. You guys know I forget those deals this really quick. Let me show you. Um, there is, well this, oh, I didn't even know there was diapers over here. This store right here has a little spot that's a clearance section. I don't know how much these diapers are. 
the stuff is kind of like everywhere. Do you know how much these diapers are? And these pull-ups down there? Um, that stuff there, here, you know? Those down there. Oh, it has the price on there. So is it half off of that, or that's already marked down? No, it's marked down. It has a regular price and then marked down. Okay, gotcha. Thank you. All right, let me see. Those are higher than the other ones, and um, that's the same brand. They're three dollars or something. See, our stickers eventually drop down to ninety percent off, and a lot of people don't know that because they're not looking for these items typically when they come into the store. Like those will be 24 cents, maybe 23. The next time um, I come in here, some of them are 50% off now, some of them are just like 25% off or it's like different percentages. So, um, There was one good one. I was I almost got it. I think it was the Delsum. I will never forget that I got that um humidifier. Not the baby one. Y'all saw my last well, I don't know if it was the last Walgreens video, but one recent one where I got the baby humidifier. And um but the one before that, it was a humidifier for the whole family and I got it for 90% off guys. I don't remember what I paid, but it was an expensive one. And that's how cheap I got it for. I'll see, um, when I first saw this, I thought it was $1.99 for the Delsum. But it'll be $1.19 when it's 90% off. So yeah, just wanted to show you guys a few things like that. I was over here, I didn't even see this one. Oh, well, that's uh -huh. Did they say last chance? No, it's not. They're gonna give us another chance and another one and another one. So I didn't see any, um, See, this is why I don't, I don't upload these videos. I've been doing Walgreens deals like all week, guys. But um, I just did. I didn't get any of the toothbrushes because I didn't have many of the $4.99 ones. And most of them are two for eight now. I did do the toothpaste. Um, please scan when, even if you have the seven off three and five off two coupons because the five off two coupon attached to this one but did not attach to this one. So I would have got to the register and the coupon would not have come off. Um, it did attach to that one. It did not attach to this or any of the other ones. And even this mouthwash, the seven off three um, or the five off two, neither one of them did not attach to this mouthwash here for the points. So I ended up getting the big mouthwash two for eight and I'm just gonna get register rewards back for that and the mouth um, and the toothpaste. I rather the points because it's a better deal with the points. When you buy two, you get 4,000 points. That's $4 versus these. When you buy two, you get a $2 register award. So it's $2. So of course, I'd rather the points, but they never have the items. Or if they do, the coupon doesn't scan or attach. So um, I'm done now, and I'm going to get out of the store. The best orange sticker I saw was the diapers for $3 and something. But of course, I don't need them. I'm so stocked on diapers. The only time I will get them is if at least $2. Not being cheap is because I've been couponing and bargain shopping so much. I know that they're going to drop. Now, if I really needed them, of course, that's a great deal. Grab them quick for $3. But I don't need them. And isn't this about a B? Look at this. Now they have these fully stocked when the, the, the deal <laughs> is dead now. Because remember, these were attaching, uh, well, we didn't have a coupon for it, but these were printing $5 register wards when you bought three of them. So for $1.79 each, you only needed three of those Dove bars. It was not working on those. At least I don't think. Oh, well, that's a 3.17, so it probably was. But um, most people are getting these. But that same evening, it was a dead deal. And this was the deal that I'm referring to. Get $5 in register rewards when you buy three or more participating Dove bath products. And it was working for those bars there. So I think these stores pulled them. They were saying they didn't have any more, but it's ironic how <laughs> they're fully stocked now. 
more sanitizer. All right, guys, so I'm gonna get out of here and get home and show you guys my um, penny video. Toodles. So y'all, who came up with this? My daughter just showed me this. Not sure how she know about it. She said she saw it on the commercial. And what did you say you gotta do again? <laughs> you gotta squeeze it and you gotta shove it up there. And then when it's full, you gotta take it out. But I don't know how you gonna do that without spilling it. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Whatever. All right, guys, what's up, YouTube friends, family, associates, and subscribers? Um, obviously, I'm back home, but right now it is, let's see what time it is, 1.30 what? 1.35 a.m. So I'm just now doing this video, guys. Um, we were actually cleaning the bathroom, organizing things, and getting um, a bunch of body wash I found and shampoo out for me to take to the market Saturday to sale. So um, I'm going to do this very quick, ex as quickly as possible to show you guys my haul. Um, I think I showed you guys the coupons for the high chew earlier um, in the video. So I don't have those here with me. But um, yeah, so of course I got those for free. These were a dollar. What? Really? <laughs> Maya? I didn't even know she put them back in here. If you just got them to eat them, you didn't have to put them back in here. I had enough to show them. But yeah, it was um, these two different flavors. And as you guys saw, I gave um, a customer four coupons because I saw her grabbing gummy bears. And I was like, do you like high chews? She was like, uh, I don't know. Um, the kids like these gummy bears. And I was like, well, here, here's some coupons. They're free. She was like, oh, sure. So she grabbed those and got them. But um, I was so surprised to find these scoonchie. And remember, I don't think it's scrunchy because there's no R in there. Scoonchie brand in the store. And please don't talk about my nails. This is that cheap polish. You you see how it rubs off? That's why I don't like that one. I just did it one night bored. Oh, and Lonnie, yours is off too. <laughs> just I guess that's from all the washing of the hands, though. Just like how they're dry and ashy. But anyway, <laughs> here, I didn't need you to um, co-sign that. Okay, Maya? Thank you. <laughs> Here's the Scoonchie brand, guys, and they have some new um, items like this that's out, so make sure you scan. A lot of them are older and look more dull. The newer ones are like bright colors, you know, almost like some of these peach and lime green and stuff like that. So I'm going to show you these as quick as I can and show you the UPC number. I may be going a little fast, just remember if you need the UPC number to um, pause the video. You know, if I've gone too fast for you. Okay, these are ribbons. The last four of the UPC number is 1171. <clears throat> these are little scrunchies. The last four of the UPC is 2864. Headbands, effortless. We'll see. Last four is 3529. more little headbands this is the bell brand or belly or bella there's no a on the end so i don't know if it's called bell but um some of these brands have penny too and they also have new ones in this brand as well so remember just to scan or go by visuals if you see one just like this and with this last um this upc number ending in this then you know it's the correct one if you can't scan um the last four is four zero five three this one is a gray and pink one with two different designs. You had that one before. Um, we had this one before? Mm -hmm. I remember those, the blue one. and green. 
Um, the last four is three nine two five. I could have sworn I just said a UPC like that. Oh no. Okay. This one is same UPC three nine two five. So any one of these two colors right here, um, it got the same UPC or a penny. And that's the same one down there, so I don't need to shake that. These little scrunchies. Last four is five, five, eight, four. These right here, the Bell brand again. Last four is four, six, one, nine. These little clips, which are really cute, by Bell as well. Five piece set. Last four, eight, one, zero, four. Bell again. Last four, four, six, one, nine. That sounds like the same. Four, six, one, nine. Yep, that's the same UPC number. It's different colors. Um, these didn't have a tag on it, so of course they just threw it in there. Some will scan another item just to charge you for these two. Like maybe scan this one two more times to charge you a penny for them if they don't have a tag. Remember, I always say that. You see items without a tag and you have a bunch of pennies, just grab them. Look at all these socks I grabbed. They weren't in a pack or anything, you know. These were like this without a tag, and they just threw them in there. You'll get that one cashier once in a blue moon that'll say, oh, I can't ring it up, it doesn't have a tag. I just tell them, hey, these are um, pennies too. So normally the manager or the cashier or the other cashier, I'll just say normally they'll just um, scan these twice just to charge me a penny for those. And most of the time they'll say, okay, because they don't feel like going to look for a tag for these, retagging them or throwing them away. They will throw them away because I find a lot of stuff in the dumpster like this without a tag. So they're not going to sell them. Um, it's very rare. Some stores will put a piece of tape on it and just put a price, but most of them just throw it away. The last four here is 7703. That's cute. Black rose. These um, are scrunchies, a four piece set. Which I'm always needing these, but I need bigger ones for my locks. <laughs> last four is 8067. Lonnie, really? You put stuff way over here. These little three piece bow by Bell. The last four of this one is 9116. It was yucky right there. I don't know what that is. But remember, this stuff is in the clearance section. You guys I always tell you to clean your hands, wash your hands really good. And of course, I have to do it again after this video, even though I've sprayed everything. Just keep doing it because millions of people. <laughs> probably not millions but maybe so thousands if not have touched a lot of this stuff that's in the clearance section because some of the stuff have been in the clearance section for years collecting dust and the price still hasn't dropped to a penny like it's just ridiculous so this is a um, some kind of fashion barrette or clip the last four is 8944 And I was so shocked to find these. I was just randomly scanning stuff at this point right here. And I found these um, scissors. It says sewing pack. So, oh yeah. I didn't even realize that. I guess it's for sewing. Is it made just for sewing? I'm trying to look at them and see. I don't know. But they were last on clearance at 150 You guys saw the clearance stickers on the rest of them. And the last four for these scissors are 2179. And um, another reason I give you guys the UPC number because you may find these items without the clearance sticker on it and still in the same area in the regular aisle, not in the clearance section. Okay? So when, you always go to the clearance section first when you're looking for pennies. At least I do. So I advise for you guys to do that first because by the time you walk around the store, Trust me, another penny shopper is in there and they're going to beat you to the clearance section and by the time you get there, there's nothing. That's the first spot that I always run to um, when I go in the store. And then I'll check everywhere else on the regular aisles. Really? <laughs> okay. Um, 
Here is another Sunchi brand. These are some sparkly cute headbands. The last four of this one is 1553. And um, I've showed you guys all of these. I'm going to put those there. Um, I just want to stop for a second to let my children know. You know, the video picks up every single thing, every sound. When I play this back, I guarantee you they're going to hear you guys whispering. I know they can hear you eating the candy. That's no problem. You messing with the chair and making it squeak. All of that's going to play back. They're trying to be so quiet. It's so funny. And I'm like, uh, no, this mic picks up everything. <laughs> A watermelon one? Oh. I'll taste some. Um I want do they taste like Starburst? They do. But they're not they sour do? though. It seems do they have the same texture as Starburst? We're talking about the high chews, you guys. Mm -hmm. I've never had them. Oh. Okay. Um, Alani found this blue dot and was so excited. I was in the clearance section, I believe in the second store. No, the third store. And she ran around the corner. Mommy, I found a blue dot. And she is so cute because she's always so excited and she's been doing this for so long with me. She is a great penny shopper. Um, Blushes Sweetly was even talking about stealing her. Like, nope, you can't have my gold. So um, you guys don't need to see the UPC number when um, I show dots. You just need to know to look for that color dot. Um, but there it is, 2575. Um, but yeah, you just have to look for dots. But they do have blue, new blue and gray dot out right now. And like I said, the older ones will look a little dull. The new ones, the color will look um, very bright. You'll see um, the blue and gray dot items. They got a lot of bright pink items like for the spring and summer. And um, like unicorns and stuff like that. Just different stuff. But um, any blue and gray dot clothing and shoes and um, especially clothing, just make sure it says F19 for year 2019 not f20 f20 is for fall 2020 the fall has not gotten here yet so that stuff will not be a penny it will be full price okay just keep that in mind just look for the year on the clothing but accessories purses and stuff like that um some have the year some don't just remember to scan okay um maya found this this is the only mask we found all day and maya found this in the back um like it had fallen down, I guess, when they pulled these or when other people were looking through the clearance section. You know how it falls down the back of the shelf? That's where you found it, right? Yeah, she found it back there. And um, all of these masks that says yes to whatever, I don't know, is that know grapefruit? Yes to. yes to grapefruit, yeah, because this is the grapefruit. And it has like different flavors. Yeah, it has different scents and mine says flavors, but yeah, That's whatever it is. I choose. Oh, yeah, that is grapefruit as well. Hmm. But um, they have a black one like this. They have different colors um, of the packagings. But just remember that word, yes. Um, I did find some that had the word yes on it on a last chance rack, and they were full price. So, again, scan. But they were a different shape than this package. So, look for the ones that has this little egg shape to it. Or, yeah, or my set of teardrop. Or a raindrop, like Alani said. <laughs> okay, I think they get it now. Um, the last four of this one is one nine nine three. Okay, so um, I believe. Well, no, that is not. Okay, you guys already saw it. Drum roll. I haven't done a drum roll in a while. Okay, <laughs> this really wasn't a drum roll because they already saw it. Mm -hmm. Um, I know you guys saw me earlier talking about these bandanas. Um, unfortunately. If you're not good in with your store, if they don't know you, you may not be able to get these bandanas. You guys did see at the register, and hopefully you heard everything. Um, when she ring it up, it says, do not sell. I don't know the reason why they can't sell these bandanas. I'm assuming it's because of the riots and everything that's been going on. Um, but the manager of this store knew me. I had already texted him um, when I spoke with his new manager. I was trying to explain to her that there may be an issue with these. That it may say do not sell. Uh, I did tell her I say I am penny shopping. Um, and I was like, you know what, pennies are right. She was like, yeah, the stuff you find that costs a penny in the store. And I was like, okay, yeah. Um, and she was like, okay, if it's an issue, I just call my boss and everything. But I texted him once I walked away from her. And um, let him know. I say, hey, I may have a problem. Um, I'm in your store. I may have a problem at your register. 
but maybe not and I was like stand by <laughs> and so shortly after that like two minutes later I heard the store phone ring and um, sure enough I believe it was him that was calling to let them know to go ahead and let me get these and um, that's what ended up happening um, it didn't even ring up for a penny it didn't come up any price you ring it up and it said do not sell but he said go ahead and just throw them in a bag for her so I don't know how many I got did you guys count these um, no? no but if you it's a few of each it's a few of each mm -hmm. if you do um if you do find them in your store it's so unfortunate if you can't get them because that sucks these are a lot of pennies and all of these are pennies they all do have the same UPC number so don't worry I'm not gonna give them all to you I flipped these two over just to check for myself and um, as you can see right here at least these two do I don't let me look at a random one yep 4015 last four four zero one five and um, I think Maya actually saw these when I was talking about the bandanas I had saw one and she was like these are it right here and she found a whole pile of them and these were originally a dollar but they are one cent if you scan it on the app i will insert a clip of me scanning a few of these so you guys can see that they did scan for a penny on the app but um if you would like to scan it <clears throat> let me go ahead and so you can get that right there and if you're on a laptop or anything you can pause it get your dollar general app or another phone and um, get your app and scan it right there to see if it's a penny in your area if you're in a different state or whatever how many 22. oh they just sat here and counted them so I got 22 of them so thank goodness for that manager um, I didn't even bother to look at them in any other stores because I don't think they would have been that kind the other stores that I went in to just give them to me like that but most stores will give you pennies anyway because they don't want to ring them up and it shows that they're not doing their job especially if you got a bunch of penny items so some of them like the one store I was at where I got these the manager wasn't there and the other girl was on the floor because she those two would have normally like scanned two of these then threw all the rest of these in a bag so it just looked like I only found two penny items <laughs> But, um, yeah, that's they're, they're supposed to pull these items off the shelf for the newbies. Um, let me let you know they're supposed to pull them off the shelf. But if we do find them in their policy, it states that they do have to sell them to us. They cannot refuse to sell us penny items, which some stores will try you anyway. So even if you're new to penny shopping, please act like you know what you're doing. Don't act like you're new and get scared and timid and shy and, you know, just leave everything there. You know let them know no in your policy you're supposed to sell me these I come here all the time I find pennies and this is the first time I'm having an issue nobody else at this store gives me an issue talk like you come to that store all the time but you've never seen that cashier you know what I mean and trust me it will work <laughs> but um and then eventually they will know you because you'll be coming there all the time um, again, I found all of these socks. They were literally all loose like this. I did not take socks out of the package. I do not take socks out of the package, and I don't advise for you to do that because typically, um, well, not typically, basically, that is stealing, okay? Um, yes, say it loud, Maya. Y'all are going to jail. <laughs> she say that all the time. Anytime I say I do something wrong, she's like, you are going to jail. It's so funny how she says it but um so yeah do not take stuff out of the packages these items that i find it always either you know they have a lot of stuff that don't have tags on it or that's out of the packages and like i said i had so many here they just throw them in the bag you know what i mean it's better when you have that many not if you just go up there with this and be like hey this is a penny <laughs> no at least if you have a lot because if you have a lot they're like okay obviously this girl knows what she's talking about because a hundred items just rung up for a penny so she can't be wrong about these being a penny you get what I mean okay um, I'm assuming you guys said yes mm -hmm. <laughs> so y'all saw these items these were just clearance items I believe these went along with the purple dot um, you really don't need to see the UPC number because these are not a penny but these are just the clearance items that I chose um, poofs or loofers I needed these I really did um, we used to buy these all the time and I just stopped buying them since I haven't been to Walmart in forever Since um, Dollar General and Walgreens is my store um, These I thought I got a deal on these until I went to the next store and I saw these on the dollar aisle <laughs> I was like, ooh, these are only a dollar. These were with these items. So I thought, you know, I was getting a deal um, I grabbed these as well. The tags look like this 
and I remember these are, did um, come out with purple dots. So these aren't purple dot items, but I believe they were they ran along with them. And um, this is not a Walgreens video, but as you guys can see, I did wind up getting these. But I got them for well, he put two dollars in. He saw it was um, when I said, "Can I get it half of that?" He did two twenty-five. So I went on ahead and grabbed those, which I may peel that off and sell these for four dollars. I don't know at the market since I'm in the market for selling right now. Um, Alani then put my other things in my video, my crest and stuff. I used the seven off three for these, the five off two for those. But this is not a Walgreens video. Let me um, show you guys my receipt really quick. And then I'm going to show you guys my dumpster dive haul, what I got in the end. Um, you're going to see Snickers and stuff up there because they were buy three, get one free. And I wanted the Snickers. I had grabbed two. So I was like, I might as well grab two more. And then you see the item for 60 cents, the um, loofers, <clears throat> and the other... Um, little thingies the bath um thing was a dollar right there and then the scrubber um things right here those were 60 cent as well here is the receipt for the face mask right there the yes to uh face mask right oh right here <clears throat> so that was one cent and i don't know what all of oh headband that's some of the hair stuff um, that we found as well. And I bought some of those garage sale labels for 75 cents because I never have prices on my things. So I may put some of those out. Um, I'm not gonna make you any promise. I may still leave everything like it is. <laughs> and here is my last receipt. This was 18 pennies and um, I paid 18 cents. And of course Dollar General is very petty to charge me one cent for tax. So I paid 19 cents total. I gave them 20 cents and got one cents back. And here you can see all the penny items. There is the scissors right there, the sewing scissors for one cent. And again, for all the newbies, because I know I get new people on my channel every day. If I ever forget to show you a UPC number on the back of an item, like that, the last four of a UPC or the entire UPC, remember it's always on the receipt. So you see where it says sewing scissors right there? Before the dash, you're gonna look before the dash, the last four is 2179, right? Okay, and here are the scissors. <clears throat> There's the UPC, 2179. So when people show their receipts, of course I am gonna always show you the receipts because again, I am Sade with the receipts and I have to bring you the receipts. So you're gonna always see the receipts. The UPC number, again, is always on the receipt under whatever item you're needing the UPC number for. Alrighty? Okay. Oh, I forgot one more. Here is the micro filtration vacuum cleaner bags. This is my first find with these right here. And you guys saw I found it behind a whole bunch of stickers and stuff. Here is the last four of the UPC number for this, 6307. <clears throat> okay, I'll be back. Okay, I am back. Um, here's my little dumpster dive haul. I did not, and I forgot to check the dumpsters at the other Dollar General because I was going to make this actually a penny in dumpster diving video. Technically, it still is, but I wanted to um, find more and show you guys the great stuff that I find in dumpsters. Um, a lot of stuff is penny stuff, and some stuff, like I said, is just like this. Nothing wrong with the stuff. It's just missing a tag or somebody's taking it out of the package. But a lot of stuff... Um, is pennies as well I don't think these were pennies um, I'm not sure I will scan them after I end this video and then if they are you guys will see because I will come back and show you anyway we found these combo pizza snacks found these um, disgusting looking I'm sorry jalapeno kettle potato they're chips all... they're pizza. not these cheddar cheese and well, they can see that. Maya's like, they're not all pizza, they're cheddar, cheddar cheese. But you the one, Maya, that said these were nasty. Um, I like jalapeno chips, but I don't know about this Clover Valley brand. They but I will not be trying them. She <laughs> said they look nasty. So we got four bags of those. One, two, three, four. Got three boxes of the combos. 
Um, she found one of the poppers. There was a lot of stuff in that bag, guys, but we did not have room in the truck because remember, I still have everything in the truck, including the table um, with the stuff that I'm selling at the market. So it's literally packed in that car. Um, she found this and it got some nasty stuff on there. Um, French vanilla coffee creamer, I guess. And this pack of apple juices that is missing too. And I don't think these are expired or anything. Let's see, November 11, 2020. So those apple juices are good. And then Alani said she wanted to do a drum roll. Which I already saw. Look at there, I got me a blender. I've always bottom, wanted though. one. You don't even bake. <laughs> Who don't bake? You a hater. What do you mean it's missing the bottom? You took it out? It's not. No, I, it's not like missing the bottom. It's just the top piece. Like you need a bowl. No, for this it. is a hand blender. Oh. Oh my goodness. My daughter <laughs> said it's missing the bottom because it doesn't have the bowl. I need a bowl for it. This is a hand a dog. blender. <clears throat> Powerful speed motor, adjustable speed, thumb tip controls, beater eject button, chrome plated beaters, easy grip handle. So let's see. Not sure why they threw this away. Nothing's wrong with the box. Um, it's in there. Yep. Everything is in here, guys. Do you think somebody returned it or something? Maybe. I don't know if that was going to throw away their returns. Um, one dumpster I haven't been to in a long time. If you guys used to watch my dumpster diving video, Aldi's was the best one. I mean, there was clothes, food. Um, but I got so good. Like, I, I wanted, I like the clothes better. You know, the food, you have to catch them as soon as they throw it away. Like, if it's frozen meats and stuff like that. Because they got a truck, I believe it was twice a week. No, once a week. Um, and if they had gotten a truck on Thursday and just shelved all of this stuff. And then they get a truck next Thursday. They have to take all of that stuff off the shelf to make room for the newer items. So, that stuff is nowhere near ex the expiration date. But, you know, they're throwing it away. And that's just a waste with all these homeless people out there, hungry people. It's just stupid. But I was right there to pick it up to donate it to the homeless homeless people. So and hungry people. So I will be um starting back my dumpster diving videos. You see I'm doing it slowly and gradually. Every time I go to the store, if I can remember to pull around the back of the store or the side and peek in that dumpster. And remember if you guys are scared, just um just say, Hey, do you have um medium sized boxes or anything back there? And I had one guy tell me yes one time, and he went to go get them, and I just stayed there. Because I'm like, this guy's going to see me out here again. I don't want to just run. And he came out with one box. I, I was at Big Lots, I remember that. Because um, he walked out as I was in the dumpster. I wasn't standing in there, but I was looking in there. And he was like, oh, yeah, sure, you need boxes? So um, just say that, you know, if you guys are scared. But um, check the laws in your state here. It just can't have a lock on it or no trespassing sign. But once can't. anything goes to the trash, it's trash to the public or whoever wants it. What'd you say, Maya? Or you can't dump your trash. Or you can't dump your trash. $2,000. Well, they know fine. that. I, I hope they do. So, guys, that is it. And um, these right here, I believe these were originally $5. Um, this just didn't have a tag on it, but I threw it in there anyway. So, yeah, just wanted to show you guys that. All right, that's the end of my messy little haul here. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for sticking with me. Welcome to all of my new subscribers. Thank you so much. And thank you for stopping by my channel and commenting um, under the video. Letting me know you're new to my channel and you're a new subscriber. Thank you so much. I appreciate the support. I love you all. I love my day ones. I love my middle ones. And I love my end ones. To the end, we will be. And I love my new ones every single day. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And Baby Sarai is doing very well. Thank you so much. And so is Baby Soleil and Alani and Q and Maya. Those are all my princesses and prince. Okay? So, um, I love you guys. You have a great night. Well, great morning. And I will see you guys on the next video. Share, share, share if you did, honey. Oh, yeah. You heard, Alani? So, wait. We got to do this right. So, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Please give the video a thumbs up, meaning like it. Please give it a thumbs down. If you don't like it, please tell a friend to tell a friend about Shade with the receipts. Please comment below and engage with me. And please share, 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 share if you did, honey. honey. And remember, watch those ads. That really helps your girls' videos out and get my coins up. Please watch the ads and don't skip them. 
And I will see you guys on the next one. Toodles. Toodles. I did forget to show y'all the rug. The rug that didn't have a tag on it. And at the same store, I got the bananas. So they did go ahead and let me. I said bananas because Alani just, <laughs> Alani just messed with me and said I kept saying bananas. The same store where I got the bandanas, um, I got the rug. And they went on ahead and let me get the rug too. So, yeah, that was the score.